Halid Murshid, CEO of e and Enterprise. It's great to have you with us here at Econo Middle East. Great to be here. Thank you. Now, what are the innovations that e and Enterprise is showcasing at this year's Jitex? Well, where do I start? Uh, at e and Enterprise uh, in, at Jitex 2025, we are showcasing how technologies can be brought into real time and real uh, use cases that creates impact in the life of our customers, in enterprise and government. When you go to our uh, stand, you will find in the cybersecurity zone, real time threat detection and threat monitoring, cybersecurity threats. And the, our ways of applying AI infused uh, use cases to detect, monitor and suppress those threats. If you go to our cloud zone, we're launching this week our uh, sovereign launchpad in cooperation with AWS, which is a breakthrough that will bring sovereignty with all the strengths of AWS uh, cloud uh, to provide uh, an infrastructure that is safe and resilient to our enterprise customers. If we go to the AI zone, you will find practical use cases that brings agentic AI into action in healthcare, industrial uh, applications, and many, many other applications. Not only that, we are also extending Chief AI Officer Program as an educational tool to practically educate the market and the executives on how and what to expect from AI in the near future. So there are a lot of things. And to complement all of that, you will find at the heart of our stand all the practical use cases. So we're not talking about futuristic, uh, you know, uh, theoretical uh, technologies. We're talking about bringing those technologies into real use cases that were implemented with customer names as an example of that implementation. Now, off the back of that, I'd like to expand on a couple of things. Mainly, what steps does e and Enterprise take to strengthen digital resilience and ensure robust cybersecurity for its clients in particular? Well, cybersecurity for us is not a technology only. It's a, a practice. And, and for us, cybersecurity is the foundation of everything that we do. So if we do a cloud solution, we embed in the design the cybersecurity aspect of that solution. If we do AI, we also have that in the design. So we do it a bottom-up approach rather than uh, a top-down. And when you talk about cybersecurity, we have a 24-7 uh, security operation center, both in UAE and in Saudi Arabia, in our presence of our help AG uh, operation, that is running uh, uh, over the clock, 24-7, uh, as I mentioned, to detect and uh, respond in real time to all the threats uh, and keep the customers that we are serving in a safe way. And um, if I was to ask you, which emerging technologies would you believe are driving the most transformative change in the industry today? What would you Say. Well, I mean, I know the, the natural answer to that would be AI, but I would say that a collective weight of AI, probably metaverse, quantum computing, and many other technologies will shape the future of uh, uh, the technology of choice. It will not be a single technology because they will all be infused together and to different solutions and use cases. I'll give you an example, for example. If you look at metaverse, you can't do metaverse without AI. And if you are going to implement, uh, uh, you know, a metaverse solution for uh, a sensitive uh, customer or sensitive data, you need cybersecurity. And with quantum computing, you need quantum safe uh, solutions as well. So if you, if you look at it, for our enterprise customers, it's not, it's not like the consumer domain where he will jump and adopt any, any technology uh, with all the you know, buzz in the market. Mm -hmm. You need an enterprise grade solution that takes into consideration a 360 view of all the aspects 
infrastructure, resiliency, data sovereignty, security of uh, your infrastructure, as much as you care about the operation and the performance. And finally, we'd like to get a bit more of an understanding on how are you leveraging digital transformation to accelerate growth and enhance business outcomes? Well, I would say digital transformation for us is a little bit different than technology adoption. Uh, you, we might confuse digital transformation uh, with uh, deploying or adopting a technology. For us, it's beyond that. Digital transform trans transformation for us is about realizing an impact on the customer. So if, if you implement certain software or transform uh, to a cloud, while the customer did not realize any benefit or any real impact out of that, for us, that's not the definition of digital transformation. So we help organizations, enterprises, and governments realize life-changing impact in their day-to-day -day operation. And we design that, we co-create that with them rather than adopting a technology or putting the KPI on the actual implementation of a certain projects. I think that's the key difference in our understanding of digital transformation than the rest of us. Khaled Merchid, thank you very much indeed for your insights. Thank you very much.